Hi guys and welcome to Autobot Offroad 101 and this video is all about discussing the proper way or the right information on how to modify your off-road vehicles. Uh, I'm Jan. Hi guys, I'm Rally. And I'm Ted. I'm Charles. Best off-road accessory shop. Congratulations to Autobot Autoworks Offroad. Now, guys, you you have a an idea already of the tires and the wheels, your recommended size for the Ranger Raptors. Now, uh, let's move on with the do's and don'ts, naman, and uh, kung ano yung mga pwedeng gawin pa with the Ranger Raptors. Uh, ito rin yung mga madalas tinatanong ng mga clients natin, and even those who are just, just nag inquire lang, no? Yes. Uh, what about the coil, coil spacers or the leveling kit? So, ano yung difference ng dalawa? So, medyo ito technical sa to. So, mga under chassis na siya. Actually, the coil spacer, ginagamit natin to for, uh, for the Ranger Raptor. Kung gusto mo magkaroon ng extra height yung sasakyan mo. Yes. That's the coil spacer. Then, the difference naman ng leveling kit na ginaga ginagamit natin is commonly used uh, word nowadays since the Raptor came out, lalo, lalo siyang sumikat. The leveling kit is used to the level. Yeah, uh, yun nga, diba, na-discuss natin kanina yung mga naka-3835. Definitely, hindi magkakasya yun sa stock na ano eh. Mm -hmm. Well, kung magkakasya man siya, sobrang liit na ng clearance sa wheel arc at saka sa... So, hindi lang sasabit siya. Yes, pwedeng mas maraming madamage, pwedeng mas mabasag yung fender, or diba, tatamaan yung suspension. Kaya, nagsasuggest tayo maglagay ng leveling kit or coil spacer. At and, least. And before we, actually way, way back, 2018, uh, we tried this first dun sa Raptor namin. Before we started recommending it sa, sa market. And after a few months, uh, yung suspension play is malambot pa rin. It's the same. Tapos, hindi naman siya nakakasira ng shocks kasi I've been using it for how many years? Two years na. And mind you guys, uh, don't get surprised when you put on more load sa Raptor nyo. Tapos bumaba siya, bumagsak. It's not because it's weak. It is really not built for uh, loading. Pangkarga. Kasi hindi naman siya molly. It's not, it's not a lip spring. It's made of coils na rin yung likod. Kaya rin, iba rin yung comfort niya compared sa pickup. Well, na nabanggit na rin nata yung na coils, no? Na rin, Let's uh, move on pero, on so, coils. Sorry, uh, since the sabi mo na hindi siya pang, pang, pang buhat niya, so mm -hmm. if that happens, anong nare-recommend natin kung, kung ibang clients, yun yung purpose nila, yung mga Ranger Raptors natin for that? For more on loading, kasi actually the Raptor kasi, it's for light load lang. Hindi siya yung pang tonetoneladang uh, uh, hakutan. Kasi coil pero, spring nga yung likod niya eh. Pero, yes. Uh, pero it still serves its purpose as a pickup. As a pick yung mga, mga hakutin ka magbiga, uh, malalaki, yung gano'n. Pero in the comfort, it's kind of different from the, the loading natin. rig. Since yan yung tinataka, let's move naman to... Ito coil spring naman. So, ano yung difference naman ng, ng coil spring with the coil spacer? So, para at least clear din siya. So, when is the time that we need the coil spring? Yes, oh, actually, we need the coil spring when we go with yung the usually term na ginagamit natin, the full build. Yes. Diba? Doon pumapasok si coil spring. Kasi, nag uh, ka ng weight eh. Yes. We added more weight to, to give way sa additional bumpers or winch or the lights Actually, we have three coil springs available, all made in Australia, Australia. which are ano ano kyan? Uh, we have the uh, the Dobinson coil spring and the Top Dog coil spring. This these two is available in, for the front and rear. Then we have the upcoming uh, King coil spring. Actually, by next week, siguro. Na, na, na delay lang eh. Pero eh, isa sa mga pinakamaganda siguro for Ranger Raptor, kasi magkakaroon siya ng ano eh, uh, ng with winch and bumper. Capable and, weight. Yes, capable. At saka magkakaroon siya ng lifted 2 inch. Mm -hmm. So, maglilip talaga yung Ranger natin ng 2 inch. And what's good with this uh, three coil spring, guys, ha, is the specific load rating na kailangan ng bawat client. Yes, tama. For, for example, yung Raptor ko, naka-winch siya, tapos naka 
bumper although may bumper is a uh, medyo lightweight, lightweight lang. lang pero, pero kinocompute mo kasi yon eh even yes. the additional light like kunwari naka-rigid ako ng radiance oh. so additional Tot weight total na, weight yung pag-uusapan oh, natin para hindi na sa sacrifice yung the comfort na binibigay na ni Raptor the the yung factory comfort so guys kahit pa sabihin natin na may mga coil spring na may specifications pa rin talaga siya na dapat yes uh, yes, yes 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 dito pumapasok kasi yung uh, technicalities and the uh, what do you call this yung knowledge ng isang shop na pinupuntahan mo it doesn't have na andiyan lahat yung parts the same parts Pwede na kinakabit na yun, pero it's the complete mixture and the the knowledge nga na i-compute mo pag samasamain to get the best hindi lang yung magandang forma it should come with the performance. So if I want the, bigger tires nga guys, parang kailangan naka cold spring na ako ganun. Pag naka bumper naka winch ka. Yes. Ah. Yes. Ulitin ko lang, we have the Top Dog, we have the Dobinsons and we have the King. This is all made in Australia. Australia. Yes. Na coils and we guarantee the the performance is tsaka yung ride niya. Is Papakita natin correct. na lang yung mga picture na nakabitan natin with the Yes. Suspense. And also, ang maganda dito uh, if you wanna make sure na totoo talaga, we have available rig when you may come and visit. Unit. May demo yes. unit ng uh, kami na full build na Raptor. So, test drive. That's the, that's the best way to explain uh -oh. eh. Mm -hmm. Or hindi yung ganito, ganyan, ganyan. Test drive. Sila mismo makakasagot kung ano yun. Sa ride, anong magiging uh, maninibago sa kanya? Meron ba? Or kailangan ba palitan din yung shocks kung pinalitan mo yung we strongly do not recommend changing the shocks because it's fox and it's very it's expensive and it's a waste to change it but the perfect way is to hindi naman to siguro ginawagawa lang na para hindi pinag-aralan na yes. compatible with the fox suspension mm -hmm. uh, kaya each brand may specific load so mm -hmm. kung gaano kabigat yung bumper mo yung winch mo yung lights mo so magre-recommend kami sa iyo kung ano yung perfect for you so in 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 relation with the coil springs, meron naman mga nagtatanong with the body lifts naman. So, ito kasi yung mga difference, diba? we have the coil spacers, the coil spring and the yes, body yes. lift. So so body lift kasi medyo complicated siya. So so what do we do uh, or what do we tell to our viewers kapag tinatanong, paano pag gusto ko body lift lang for my Ford Raptor? Is that even possible or Actually this is what we use pag nag body lift tayo is a plastic engineered uh, spacer yeah. uh, a little history body lift kasi it's uh, commonly used in australia where it is the off-road capital of the world one of the safest way to get a higher or a taller rig is the drop kit mismo pero since australia the country their country is not allowed na gumawa ng mga drop, drop kits. kits kasi ma sobrang marami silang technicalities yes. and safety measures yes. and hindi inaalaw ng country nila. That's where the body lift comes in. Pero since here in our country, drop kit is uh, available, so we recommend it. Lalo na sa mga uh, different rigs na tinatransform namin. But with the Raptor, since nga, uh, what we've said earlier, di ba? Ayaw natin palitan yung shocks kasi it's very expensive and it's a waste of money to change it, di ba? Mm -hmm. So, this is where the body lift comes in. Body lift, nilalagay natin to between the chassis, chassis and, body. And, and the body. So, this is the uh, thickest or the tallest na nire-recommend namin kasi pag masyado ring mataas, it's not safe anymore kasi you will be separating the chassis and the body. So, so magkakaroon ng body roll, especially sa mga hairpin, sa mga curves. Lalo na rin kung pinapang everyday nyo siya, tapos uh, uh, mabilis yung takbo. So, it's not that safe. Pag, mas taller than this one. But with this one, it's the safest way. And hindi siya magkakaroon ng uh, mm, yung iniisip nyo baka bumaliktad or what. Kasi, dito na kasi papasok yung wheel set natin na malalaki. The yes. 20 by 12, negative 44. Uh, 38. Tapos 38. So, it's... Kaya... Kung may nakikita nyo, yes. uh, papakita naman natin yung yes, mga nagawa na natin, natin. Uh, 38s and uh, yun, 37s. Actually, uh, may mga gustong gumawa ng yeah. 40s, pero, di ba? Uh, 
soon siguro we'll be doing siguro pag ano rating na yung rigear natin for the ano, the rigear Those, the that's rock one rock. technicalities na naman that so pero we'll we won't be discussing that de, wala on, pa rin naman available uh-oh. for now eh but those are those are the types of uh, you will consider when building mga sobrang laki na but we'll be discussing it in different uh, episode Pakita ko lang din yung tornillo na ginagamit natin. Uh, high tension na siya. So, mm-hmm. pinapalitan natin. Safe siya. Hindi siya basta-basta nababali o napuputol. Mm-hmm. Kasi yun din ang commonly problem sa mga nakabody lift. Ginagamitan ng ordinary na bolts, nababali. Yes. And, uh, yung ganito, bakal yung ibang ginagamit. Yes, yes. So, yung nagkakaroon ng ingay. Yes, squeaking uh, sound. So, ito perfectly cut siya. Eh. Oh. Pinamachine chop talaga natin para maayos yung cut. Pantay-pantay siya. And go to your trusted off-road shop. Yes. For safety, buhay yan, sarili nyo may sakay minsan kasakay nyo pa yung anak nyo, pamilya nyo so, tsaka hindi naman natin best. ginagawa kung hanggat hindi natin nasusubukan na yes, safe yes, yes. Yes. Okay. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. So, so speaking of safety, uh, since medyo complicated si body lift no? uh, isa ba to sa mga nire-recommend nyo, how safe is safe with body lift? Para it's safe safety. as long as, yung mga ganito ka properly installed, uh, not too much na, lagi naman tayong before the borderline eh Ayaw natin mag just to get the pogi points that so, we wanted. Yes. Tapos, mag-sacrifice yung, yun nga. Kasi di ba iba yung price ni Body Lift with the coil spacers and the, I mean, yes, the coil springs. This no? one, actually, pumapasok lang naman to when you want the, the monster builds. The monster diba? builds. Yung mga 38 natin. Di ba, Charles? 37. May sasalita, Charles. Eh. 37. <laughs> Ito kasi si Charles, ano eh, uh, busy dun sa affordable niya. <laughs> uh, actually, we have a one, one more page, the affordable mags and tires. It is handled by Charles. So, yung mga yung mga best deals. Kaya huwag kayong magtaka yung mga ibang build namin. Nakapost din doon eh. Mm-mm-mm. It's under one umbrella. Yeah. I think, uh, na-discuss natin na yung mga kailangan. Yes, uh, one, la- one last thing. No? Ito pa yung isa. Kasi minsan, kung ayaw, parang ganito yung offset ang na gusto nila. Ang ginagawa nila is the wheel spacer. So, okay. ano naman yung wheel spacer, guys? Sa wheel spacer naman, no, hindi natin siya nire-recommend talaga. Pero may mga ibang customer, syempre, gusto nila yung base, na. basic muna yung setup. Parang ayaw mo nang palitan yung mags and tires. Yung dyan gusto mo nang, si ano eh, tipid mills. Yes, gusto mo nang pagsawaan yung mags and tires nila. Uh-huh. Hanggang later on, saka sila mag-upgrade ng wheels. Para lang makuha natin yung medyo perfect offset, tinatawag mo. Kasi positive offset yes, nga yung wheels uh-huh. ng, ano eh, ng Raptor eh. Actually, this is... Pang pogi points na lang Pang pogi points na lang, oo. Pang Pero hindi points. namin siya nire-recommend, ha. Be sure, pag nagkabit kayo nito, medyo nakakabit ng maayos, tsaka time to time, kailangan siya i-check, eh. Kasi so, pwede siya lumuwag, eh. Retighten. Retighten. So, as a total, guys, no, um, kapag nag-wheel spacer ka, tapos gusto mo mag-trail, save ba nun? Yeah. Okay pa rin naman. Okay pa rin naman. Marami, uh-huh. na, marami naman nag-trail na naka-wheel spacer, eh. Pero, uh-huh. Ang additional ano niya lang, kailangan mo lang siya i-check time to time. time. Proper maintenance. Hindi mm-hmm. siya yung, uh, uh, yung drive. High maintenance. Yes. 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 At saka available pa rin naman dito sa oh. shop natin si uh, Will Spacer. Yung regular one and saka yung may hub centric. Yes. Pero we, we wanna make sure before you, before us selling it to you, uh, gusto namin paintindi muna what comes with it. Uh, medyo ma... Uh, yung... You need to be a more responsible on owner kasi you you need to check and tighten regularly the wheel spacer so you have to Saka yung commonly problem yung no mugs to oh. para ma-check. Yung commonly problem no nadodoble sila ng gastos. Mm-hmm. When yes. the time na mag upgrade na sila ng wheels, yes. tatanggalin natin na yung wheel spacer. Mm-hmm. Saka magkakaroon ka ng konting steering vibration. So better pa rin na mag-upgrade na lang ng wheel set. Yes. 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 Oh. May mga trade-in offers naman tayo eh. yung mm-hmm. mga syempre Anong gagawin namin sa wheels namin, yung sa tires namin? Yes, we accept yeah, trading. Oh. Yes. Kaya natin binuksan yeah. din si Affordable para oh. matulungan natin yung mga iba na wala silang nagagawa sa mag and tires sila. Natatambak so, na lang. So, di ba? Yung mga... It's, it takes space, eh. Okay, so just to give a recap, guys, no? uh, don't forget, uh, marami namang possible ways to, uh, to upgrade your Ranger Raptors. Uh, but always, always go to your trusted shop Uh, na nagbibigay talaga ng quality no, when it comes to uh, modifying your off-road vehicles when transforming your off-road vehicle. So, uh, better ask the specific questions. At least this video will help you on uh, give you a, a bit of uh, right knowledge and information in modifying your off-road vehicle. So, so at least um, if you have any more questions, guys, uh, 
please do comment on uh, the uh, comment uh, uh, the 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 comment section. Kung mayroon kayo mga tanong, we'll be gladly to answer them then on the, on our next video. Uh, and our next video will be discussing naman uh, kung ano yung pwede namang mga bumpers, uh, bumpers and winch and uh, for the Ranger Raptors. Saka yung roll bar na rin kasi uh, uh, roll bar. added weight na rin yun sa ano. Uh, added weight na kasi siya. So, ito naman yung mga specific. So, kasi kung ngayon discuss natin, uh, medyo mga ba siya. We'll be, yes, we'll be uh, doing more episodes marami. discussing specific upgrades para uh, na-explain siya na mas makayon. Sorry guys, last yeah, question. Sure. Kasi siyempre ito na nindiscuss natin. Price range for the wheel sets. Yon. Oh, yun yung mga madalas set. Ayoko pag-usapan yan. Nabiro lang. Ano na yung last question? The price range for the wheel set. Uh, we have the the best brands that we carry behind our company. Uh, alam nyo naman siguro, we, we have the XD and the Fuel as our main brand when it comes to wheels and you can check it on the site you can google it for the testimonials it is the number one off-road wheels in the world actually the before uh, fuel and, uh, and xdkmc yeah. are mortal enemies not until last year kahit kami nag nagkagulo nagulat din kasi nagsama ang dalawang biggest wheel, off-road wheels company worldwide. Kaya ngayon, it is under our umbrella na, uh, thank God, the Fuel and the XD. The Fuel, the 17x9's Fuel is how much? Uh, 50,000 50, SRP. 50, I think 50,000 to 60,000 kasi yes. some of the designs are, no, 50,000 to 75,000 yes. kasi we have the Covert, the Sapir. Uh -huh. yeah. Pero 80% of the design is at 50,000. 50, or are counting konti na mas mataas siya and then the 20 uh, the 18 Mr. 18 around 60,000 to 65,000 yeah kasi mostly 18 by 9 18, 18 by 10 by 9 and 18 by 10 yeah, so then and 20s then we have the 20s 20s we have 20 by 9 we have 20 by 10 we have 20 by 12 we have special orders the 20 by 14 so yung yeah. price range niya is 75 to 125. Yeah, 125. How about the tires naman? The price range for the tires? Regarding sa tires, sobrang ang dami eh. Pero yes. siguro magbigay na lang tayo ng mga... Mga ball park, yeah. ball park figure lang naman. Para sa 285-7017 kasi at saka 285-5520, nag-i-start ng 12,000 okay. up to 40,000 each. Pero medyo high-end brand na to, no? Hindi, we carry what we recommend. Yes. Okay. Kung may gusto talaga si client, especially kung hindi na pumapasa sa tamang standard basta pumasok na lang sa presyo pero hindi pasok sa atin uh, we're sorry to say na we don't carry it kasi may nakik nakikita naman siguro nyo guys yung may mga some accidents na nag sa road mga nabasag na wheels so biglang sumabog yung tires because of the low quality so that's what we are avoiding and it's our company who's behind it it's on the line we don't want to be uh, Da, ano ba yun? Dab about na yes. you know, Sa every build the, naman natin Safety first eh Yun yes, naman talaga yung yes. ano natin So we, we We mostly use the BFG tires The Master, Fuel tires Mastercraft. Mastercraft USA The Nito The Cooper Monsta, Monsta Australia Tapos AMP Dick Sepek Yung mga yun And uh what an charge? You can, uh, speaking, speaking of ano, uh, Tapos isa Nito, sa favorite ko ay yung Nito, Nito Ridge Mad. and Nito Mad. Nito Mad Grappler yes. yung na-meet natin yung nag-design mismo ng ano. Yes, actually sa Japan. back in earlier sa, this year in Tokyo, Tokyo Auto Salon, Salon yes. we met I forgot his name pero pakita na lang natin. May, we have picture, a picture. Pakita yes, natin yung yes, picture. Yes, we are so honored to It's one actually it's my favorite tire, the Nito Mad Extreme. That's why both of my rigs is uh uh, using Nito the Nito Mod. So, sobrang aggressive naman so, talaga nun eh. And I don't yeah. mind the little noise. Yes. Uh, Na-enjoy ko siya eh. Parang nasa aeroplano. Sa, sa noise naman, sanayan naman yun eh. Mm. Uh. Tsaka ayaw ko talaga may kausap pag nag-drive. <laughs> I think guys, okay na na pag-usapan natin na lahat. May gusto lang akong sabihin, isa. Uh, guys, we are not uh, we are not the experts. Yes, yes. But uh, we know a little and we keep on learning and uh, we guarantee this. I guarantee when we build something, when we you let you trust us with your rig, 
we give you more than 100% of our services. And yun, yeah, we are not experts, hindi kami magaling, hindi kami nagmamagaling. We are all the same, pero it's siguro yung enthusiasm namin and we are so happy when we finish one build at a time. Yun. So so thank you guys for staying uh, with us in this uh, on this video. Uh but to, to let you know no, uh syempre we're in the middle of ECQ ngayon or MECQ. Uh we're not wearing masks, but uh rest assured that this room was properly disinfected. Uh it was lang tayo dito. so at kami lang naman nandito, only the videographer is here that was telling apat and um it's very very safe so uh, don't worry about that. Uh, you know, we want to let you know that even though that we're doing this video, uh, we're still uh, making sure that all the measures were properly yes. met. Okay, so thank you guys. Uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below and uh, turn on the notification bell for at least updates. Pag mayroong updates. Uh, don't forget to like our Facebook page and Instagram page, uh, Autobot Autoworks Off-Road for more quality built rigs. The Autobot Way. We have a bag on page, ngayon, guys. I'm going to manage nun. So, the Autobot Off Road merchandise will be bringing out a new set of designs for the t shirts, for the uh, polo shirts, and for masks. the caps, oh, and the mats. So, we're going to have the caps, uh, yeah. sunglasses. Oh, Sunglasses. Yes, even underwear. <laughs> even underwear. <laughs> 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 so, magkakaran kayo. Uh, Meron yung page. So don't forget to like that page also. Uh, what else? Ano ba ba? For the price. Kasi siguro yung mga important details, lagay natin na lang sa, uh, sa description uh -huh. lahat. Yeah, so we'll, we'll let you know. Uh, marami pa naman susunod na mga segments and videos after this. So, thank you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, okay, thank you, thank you. Anyway, See you again. God bless. Stay safe. Bye.